Hello guys, it's Miranda Jones here, back again with another video. In today's video, I'm going to be doing an Aberdeen transfer latest news update, whatever you want to call it. Um, on the latest like transfer news, obviously, I've just got a quick warning that I will be doing a lot of these transfer videos, either if it's around Europe or the world, uh, Man United or Aberdeen. I'll be I'll be uploading a bit more because of all the transfer latest. So let's get straight into this video. So we've got four transfers to talk to you about. And the first transfer is Connor Barron. Now he's been linked with Celtic and a number of clubs because of his performance la the last season. He obviously been, he's been um, scouted by Jim Goodwin and he's in, a, he's in the first team. He was, be, he was outstanding. Obviously he came through the youth ranks with Calvin Ramsey and he has done an absolutely superb job um, in that midfield. He has carried Aberdeen at some points of this season. Obviously Aberdeen have been actually terrible this season but Conor Barron hasn't. He's been a main star and Celtic have been linked with a move for him. He, he's probably going to cost around one to three million. Not expecting much money um, but he is a fantastic player and I've got to give him credit this season. Obviously, Jim Goodwin did scout him in the first place, and he has been outstanding. I've got to give him credit. Of course, he's going to get scouted by you. Of course, he's going to get linked by big clubs. He's, he did outstanding last season. Uh, so, the first transfer, he has Connor Barron has been linked with Celtic. Next transfer we're talking about is Liam Scales from Celtic. Now, he's been linked with a move to Aberdeen. Uh, he's a great. I've not seen not seen him a lot this season, but he's a good left back. Obviously, Jack McKenzie, he's good and all, but Liam Scales has been playing for Celtic, and Celtic did win the league last season. So, yeah, he he's been linked with Aberdeen these past few days, and he's a great. He's a good target. I spoke to him about him in my last transfer video, I think, and. I, I I did I did I did say he was a promising player for Aberdeen, and um, I I think we could do with a, a left back. Obviously, we've got Jack McKenzie, as I said earlier, who is a promising talent. But Liam Scales has just got that Celtic experience, that title-winning experience, and I think we could do with a player like him, just to put in the balance of the team, um, and. Um, yeah, that's why Jim Good he's one of Jim Goodwin's first on the books, um, and because because of his because of experience in the in the Celtic squad, and we could really do with someone like that in our team. So Liam Scales to Aberdeen has been linked. The next transfer we are talking about is Calvin Ramsey. Now he has been linked with a massive move to Liverpool, and I did say. In these past few videos of uh, five Aberdeen targets and this video, that he has been linked with a lot of clubs, and uh, there's no wonder why. Last season he was outstanding. Obviously he came in, and uh, people thought we didn't we didn't know much about him. Obviously he made his debut against Dumbarton in that Scottish Cup game where we snitch snit sn we snitched a win. Um, and I think he he's got balance. He's got a lot of um, he's got a lot of good qualities. His crossing is good. Obviously, assisted Ramirez about five or six times this season, and um, yeah, he's definitely got the talent. And that's why obviously Liverpool are looking for um, a a backup right back to Trent. Obviously, they haven't got really an a, a, um a backup fullback, but. Calvin Ramsey is your man. They're looking at around six to seven million, which is a lot for Aberdeen. We can spend a lot of money with that, and that's why Liverpool after him. I've heard the deal is done, but I'm not sure about that. I don't know if it's done yet. Um, obviously, 
he's not he's definitely not going to turn down Liverpool for Aberdeen no chance not a chance in the human books is Calvin Ramsey's going to turn down Aberdeen for Liverpool he's not doing that so Calvin Ramsey's Liverpool is probably nearly done and he, he's probably going to be joining Liverpool in these next few weeks maybe in the summer and the last transfer we are talking about is Yilba Ramadani who has signed for Aberdeen I think he was last Monday uh, f- for a three-year contract for the Dons. He he is a very promising player, and that's why Jim Goodwin's looked at him over these last few weeks or months. And he's a hard-working player. We I've seen a few clips of him. He can score. He can also score goals from midfield. Him and Connor Barron in the min- in the midfield is a definitely a great partnership, and will do well next season. Um, we just got hope. He uh, we, he can he puts in crunch and tackles. He he's a hard work well, a hard working player. He's played against big countries like England and uh, a few other a few other big nations. So he's got the the big game experience. Um, we'll just see how he does in a game against Celtic or Rangers. Um, and hopefully he does well. I'm looking. I'm lo- he's a great player. And um, I can't wait for him to join the squad and uh, get. I, I presume he's going to start next season. I don't think he he won't be. I don't think he'll be on the bench because um, we need a midfielder. We're obviously looking at a few others. Um, but Yelba Ramadani is a confirmed signing, first signing this season under Jim Goodwin, and uh, it's a good signing. Hard working player, talented, and um, Yelba Ramadani to Aberdeen is official. And there's a great signing to the squad. So I do hope you enjoyed this video. Please can you uh, like this video, subscribe to the channel, and hit the notification bell so you're not afraid every single time I do a video. And see you next time. Bye. And I'll be back for some new transfer news soon. See you guys.